8th International Day of Yoga, the 21st of June 2022. International Day of Yoga, IDY, is celebrated every year on June 21st to spread awareness about the significance and advantages of yoga. It was first recognized by the United Nations General Assembly in 2014. The theme for the year 2022 is Yoga for Humanity. The main event of the 8th edition of the International Day of Yoga, IDY 2022, will be celebrated at Mysuru Palace, Karnataka. Union Minister Hardeep Singh Puri launches Nippon. Union Minister Hardeep Puri on 20 June 2022 launched an innovative project or national initiative for promoting upskilling of Nirman workers or Nippon in New Delhi. It is an initiative of the Ministry of Housing or Urban Affairs. It aims to train over 1 lakh construction workers through fresh skilling and upskilling programs and provides them with work opportunities in foreign countries. Max Verstappen wins Canadian F1 Grand Prix. Red Bull or S Max Verstappen won the Canadian Grand Prix on the 19th of June 2022. This was Verstappen or S26 GP win of his career or 67th podium finish. Carlos Sainz and Lewis Hamilton came at second and third positions respectively. Verstappen has won six races in 2022 so far Saudi Arabian GP, Amelia Romagna GP, Miami GP, Spanish GP, Azerbaijan GP, and now the Canadian GP. Hamad International Airport named world's best airport for 2022. Qatar or S. Hamad International Airport has been named the world's best airport for the year 2022. The announcement took place at the Skytrax 2022 World Airport Awards, held at Passenger Terminal Expo in Paris, France on 16 June 2022. The World Airport Awards are the most prestigious accolades for the airport industry, voted by customers in the annual Global Airport Customer Satisfaction Survey. PM inaugurates several projects worth 33,000 crore rupees in Bengaluru. PM Modi laid the foundation stone and inaugurated several projects worth 33,000 crore rupees in Bengaluru on the 20th of June 2022. He inaugurated the country or as third fully air-conditioned railway terminal and laid the foundation stone for over 15,000 crore rupees Bengaluru suburban railway project. Five national highways and seven railway projects were also launched by the Prime Minister. India's first 100 MLD desalination plant inaugurated in the Hage, Gujarat. Gujarat CM Bhupendra Patel on 16 June 2022 inaugurated India's first 100 mld million litres capacity desalination plant at the Hage in Bharuch district. The plant has been set up by the Gujarat Industrial Development Corporation with an investment of 881 crore rupees. It can desalinate 100 million litres of water. It will only supply water to the industries in the area. NMA to study movement of sun around Kutub Minar. National Monuments Authority, NMA, on 21 June 2022 will organize an astrophysical analysis of the movement of the sun around the Kutub Minar. The study will determine if Kutub Minar is tilted at a certain angle, does it have any astronomical significance, and whether there is a zero shadow of the minaret at local noon on 21 June. National Monuments Authority Chairman Tarun Vijay. IIT Jodhpur develops indigenous metal 3D printer for aerospace. IIT Jodhpur has indigenously developed a metal 3D printer for aerospace, defense and general engineering applications. The printer is based on direct energy deposition technology. All the components of this printer, except the laser or robot systems, are designed or manufactured in India. The project or S main objective is to reduce the cost of metal 3D printers or attract a broader range of users. Protean and Peniabai tie up to offer paperless PAN services. Protean Ego Technologies Ltd and Peniabai have partnered to offer PAN related services for Peniabai's retail partners. It will facilitate quick or easy access to online PAN services in neighborhood stores at affordable rates. 
Protean accepts or processes PAN applications on behalf of the income tax debt. Under the collaboration, PNBI will work as the PAN service agency of Protean. Kotec General Insurance partners with Phonepay to offer motor insurance. Kotec General Insurance has partnered with Phonepay to offer motor insurance to its 380 million customers on the Phonepay platform. Through this ship, Phonepay customers would be able to buy car and two-wheeler insurance online in just a few clicks from the comfort of their smartphones. Neeraj Chopra